Hey ladies and gentlemen, this is a long overdue tutorial on how to wrap your hands during your boxing sessions. First things first, unroll your wraps. So you start off with the loop, alright? And remember with your wraps, you need to make sure to protect your knuckles and wrap your wrists. So your wrist is sturdy. Grab the loop, put it on the tip of your pinky. And you're going to create a pad about just a little bit wider than your own hand. Alright, so to do that, put in your pinky. Now you're going to use the tip of your index finger. And then what you're going to do is you're going to count. So start off there, put the middle of the wrap on the tip of your finger, like so. And then you're going to count mm, an average hand about four, four times, so that's zero. That's one. So remember, tip of your index, tip of your pinky. That's two. That's three. And that's four. Alright. So let it dangle. Grab the middle of the pad that you have created. Alright. Knuckle facing you. Now you're going to put it over the top. And you're going to pinch the wrap between your index finger and your thumb to hold it in place. So the other piece is dangling outside your pinky and you want to go under your knuckles, go over the top of your knuckles, same with your thumb, put pressure on the top, take your thumb out and then pinch it again. Now that's in place, right. over the top, thumb out, adjust it so it's tight. All right. Now over the top. Now from there, outside of your pinky, pinky, you're gonna go under your wrist, over the top of your wrist. Let's go two times. So that's one. That's two. And go under. And then from here, you go over the top of your thumb, like that, all the way around, and then over the top of your wrist again, like that. Now you're gonna start the finger pattern. So you're going to go under your wrist, now you're going to go between each finger. So between your pinky and your ring, and you're going to go to the outside, and then you're going to go under to the outside between your thumb and your index. Alright, so that's right there, over the knuckle, under the hand, to your wrist, over the wrist. Now your next finger, all right, between the middle and, the, and ring finger, yeah, and then under, between your thumb and index, over your knuckles, under your hand, under your hand, to over your wrist. Now the last finger, all right, index, middle, like so. All right, now this time instead of go between the thumb and the index, you want to go the opposite way. So you go between that finger, now you want to go to the outside of your pinky. Alright, so grab it. Now, see, outside, over the top of your whole hand, to the back of your thumb, right here. And you're going to go under your thumb, and you're going to lock everything in. Under your thumb, and then come across, maybe your other hand. And that's it, now finish the rest around your wrist, making sure you're doing it in the X pattern. There you go, turn her over, that's it. Grab everything up. Now when you put in your glove, you've got a big gap there, so it's not bulky here, and it's unnecessary wrapping here, so you've got air to breathe, and it feels better in the glove. you got more protection here, and more protection there. All right. So that's how you wrap it. Left side. Come on. All right, remember, you got to create a pad for the knuckles. So remember, pinky, tip, tip, and let's go four. So that's zero. One, two, three, four. Dangle, grab the middle. All right, pinch it with your thumb. Let the wrap dangle outside your pinky, put it over the top, 
over the top. Yep. Yeah. Take your thumb out, adjust it so it's tight. Not too tight. You don't want to stop the blood bleeding. Alright, yeah. under your wrist. Over the wrist two times. One, two, over the thumb, under the thumb, over the wrist, pattern, pinky, knuckle, wrist, next finger. Knuckle, Oop. wrist, next finger, last finger, now opposite outside, under the thumb, over the hand, under the wrist, and finish everything off. One, two, and three. Turn it over, grip everything together. Alright, there you go. That's how you wrap your hands. Alright, session is done. Boot camp's over. You want to re wrap your hands. So re roll it in a nice, tight roll. But this is what you do. Come closer so you see. Alright, so start off with the loop, bend it. Now you want to create a little little roll. So as tight as you can, go about five times. One, two, three, four, five. So you've got that roll. Now what you want to do is apply pressure and roll at the same time so you get that tight tightness in your roll. So the best way to do it is put it in your hip on your thigh, place it, now put some pulling pressure on it, and then roll. So as you roll. Pull it, and then apply pressure, roll. Pull, apply pressure, roll. You know, that's all you do, just keep repeating that. So you got tension all the way through. Keep going. That's it, all the way through. It takes a while to get used to, but once you get used to it, it's real quick. It's just juggling a little bit. Your fingers might get tired, but it's all right. So keep going, remember, pull, apply pressure, roll, pull, apply pressure, roll. Alright, we done. Keep going, apply pressure, pull, apply pressure, roll, pull, apply pressure, and roll. There you go, done. Like brand new. And that's how you get your hand wrap back to its tight roll. Alright, if you like the video, like the video, subscribe, come have a try at our boot camp session. We start our next program soon, so see you guys there.